tells me that the God behind this book comes down my level, speaks my language. That means I can read about Him in every language, which tends to suggest to me that this is the universal God, and this is only the God for the Arabs. <laughs> but let's get back to this name Issa. Because yeah. you say if it's, pure, if it's in pure Arabic, it has to be in Arabic, and therefore Issa must be an Arabic name. Issa is not the Arabic name for Jesus. Ask any Arab speaker, especially a Christian Arab speaker, and they'll tell you what the real name in Arabic is for Jesus. And it's Yeshua. It has always been for Yeshua. For 2,000 years, it's Yeshua. In fact, you will not find the word Issa before the Quran. The word Issa does not exist until the Quran introduced it. So that is the Quranic name for Jesus. So where did the Quran get it from? Or where did Muhammad get it from? Since mm -hmm. he spoke supposedly pure Arabic. Mm -hmm. Well, he couldn't read or write. We know that. So whoever wrote it down wrote the wrong name. You've mm -hmm. got the wrong Jesus. Well, I'll tell you the answer. We pretty well know the answer now. We didn't for many years because we always thought maybe this was Esau, the brother of Jacob. They probably got confused. Maybe the Jews gave him the wrong name as a, as a joke. Nonetheless, they should have had, if it was a true prophet, if Muhammad really was a true prophet, why didn't he know God's name? And why didn't he also know Jesus' name mm -hmm. in Arabic? Take a look at the Quran. You will find that Issa is referred to about 93 times. 93 times all the way through. How many times is Muhammad referred to in this book? Four times. Four times, that's it. So who do you think is more important? Hmm. Now all the way through in the book it does talk about the messenger, the prophet, the messenger, the prophet, but it doesn't give him a name. Muslims have to put that in parentheses. In the English translation or whatever translation, they have to add that to the text. It's not in the Arabic. His name is not there except for four times. Mm -hmm. Whereas Issa's name is all the way through. It's replete. 93 times you'll get him over and over again. Many times Issa ibn Maryam. Issa ibn Maryam means Issa, son of Mary. Twenty-five times he's the son of Mary to show his humanity. Mm -hmm. But I still want to know why Issa is there. 